Here is another look. Watch the 43 inside him. They actually made a little contact as they got down into the turn, and then they got hooked together, and when they came apart, the 11 car took a pretty hard lick into the outside wall. And the 75 of Marty Houston is going to spin. There we see the contact. Ooh, the rear tires come off the ground, and he'll come around and smack this wall hard with the left side. So the Spear Chevrolet, an innocent victim in this one. Oh, big fire. The 75 of Marty Houston as he has made strong contact with the wall and has slid down to the infield portion of turn four. Now up ahead of this, the double zero has bounced off the wall, so everybody's trying to check up. Now how in the world Kurt Busch even made it back onto the racetrack without wrecking there? Jim Smith didn't think that was going to happen. He wanted his driver to win, so he actually entered a few extra trucks in that race, and one of them happened to take out Brendan Gaughan, and Brendan was not happy at all. Big time. 